From the hot deserts of Australia to the bustling markets of Europe, goats are quietly shaping the future of global agriculture. With their hardy nature, delicious lean meat and nutritious milk, they have become a symbol of sustainable agriculture, thriving even in environments where other livestock struggle. In today's video, we explore the amazing journey of millions of goats from farm to table. You'll see how tradition and modern technology blend to make goat farming one of the fastest growing agricultural sectors in the world. Across Australia's vast grasslands, more than 2.3 million feral goats roam free, descendants of animals brought by early settlers. Each year, more than a million of these goats are rounded up by skilled teams of herders, dogs, four-wheel drive vehicles and even helicopters before being transported to slaughter. This extensive system, known as pasture grazing, requires minimal infrastructure and relies heavily on the animal's natural ability to forage on dry land. For farmers, it provides a steady income with limited management costs, as goats are incredibly hardy and can survive severe droughts and sparse vegetation. In addition to this traditional approach, more and more producers are turning to intensive, closed-loop farming systems. where goats are kept in climate-controlled barns where temperature, humidity and nutrition are closely monitored. Globally, around 20% of goat farms have adopted this approach, focusing on maximising milk production, improving carcass weight and standardising quality. By combining traditional and modern pasture grazing, the industry ensures that goats continue to thrive in a variety of conditions, meeting the growing global demand for both meat and dairy products. Keeping goats healthy starts with creating optimal environmental conditions. Research shows that goats thrive in temperatures between 15 DEC and 25 DEC, with humidity between 50% and 70%. In the hot Australian summer, constant access to water is essential to prevent heat stress, while in colder regions, shelter and bedding protect against frostbite. Nutrition also plays an important role. Adult goats consume about two to three pounds of feed per day, including nutritious hay, grains and seeds. Hay is typically fed twice daily, while grains provide energy in the morning. Kid goats are weaned at six to eight weeks and dairy goats typically reach full maturity around 18 months. Unlike cattle or sheep, goats eat a wide variety of shrubs, weeds and other plants, making them more resilient to fluctuations in feed prices Daily outdoor exercise is also essential, with goats being allowed outside for at least two hours of sunlight and free range, which helps maintain both their health and productivity.
Milking begins soon after the baby is born, when natural lactation takes place after birth. Goat milk production peaks during the 21-day estrus cycle, and with proper care, a healthy adult goat can produce between three and five litres at a time, milked twice daily, and produce up to 300 litres per year. Small-scale farms typically use semi-automatic machines capable of milking around 20 goats at a time, while commercial dairies use advanced rotary platforms. In these systems, goats enter individual pens, their udders are cleaned and suction cups are automatically attached. Goat milk is renowned for its high nutritional value, being rich in protein, essential vitamins and minerals, and is easily digestible, making it a great alternative to cow's milk for those who are lactose intolerant. The process of turning milk into cheese is a delicate art. First, the milk is filtered to remove impurities, then gently heated while the enzyme rennet is added to initiate the coagulation process. Within minutes, the liquid separates into curds and whey. The curds are cut and stirred to release excess whey, then poured into molds where the cheese begins to form. Salt is added to preserve flavour and extend shelf life, and the cheese is aged for two to six weeks to develop complex aromas and textures. Globally, goat cheese production exceeds two million tonnes per year, with countries such as Italy, France, Spain, the United States and Greece leading the way in consumption. Premium cheeses such as Pecorino Romano can sell for up to $300, zero cents per kilogram, highlighting the economic potential of this versatile dairy product. In addition to direct use, goat milk is also processed into many different products, from artisanal cheese, yogurt, ice cream, to skincare products, demonstrating its diversity and value. With high nutritional value, goat milk is not only a nutritious food source, but also popular in the cosmetics industry, thanks to its ability to moisturize and soothe the skin, helping to maintain smooth and healthy skin. The versatility in these applications opens up many business opportunities in both the food and beauty sectors. On the meat side, modern abattoirs prioritise animal welfare to ensure a high quality product. Goats are rested beforehand to reduce stress, then led through controlled corridors into the slaughter area. Stunning, bleeding, skinning and evisceration are performed under close supervision. Once cleaned, the goats are cut into pieces for processing. This method maximises shelf life, maintains product integrity and reduces processing costs for international shipments. Which product do you think is the most promising? Goat meat, goat milk, or cheese? Could goats overtake sheep as the top livestock choice in 20 years? 
Share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell to stay tuned for more interesting information about the fascinating world of agriculture.